hello everyone welcome back to my channel in this video i am going to explain you how to make the carousel uh, the carousel which we are making which is an instagram carousel you can see at the top so here in this carousel we can uh, slide our uh, slide the status um, after the click clicking on this left icon and the right icon and we can also slide uh, without clicking on the button as you can see so this uh, this thing which we, uh, these things we are going to make today and you can if you want you can also follow me on instagram for any query so let me just close this and here you can see i already made this uh, you can see we have uh, <coughs> this button when you click on this it will move left or right and you can also slide uh, slide the carousel and you can also see the border is which is uh, uh, looks like it's an instagram so let me show you in the code so here uh, here is the folder structure you can see uh, which uh, we currently have like let me tell you one thing uh, here is the component folder uh, which contains the component which we have used in which we have used in this project uh, and we have this styles folder in which we contain all the css part and uh, here is the data.js file uh, inside this data.js file i have uh, i have an array of object which contain the image and the name okay so let me let us just move in the app.js file uh, inside this app.js i have imported this carousel component and i have this um, css files in which we have written over all the css uh, and uh, and inside the uh, we have this section tag uh, in which i put the name is carousel status and we have this carousel component okay so let us move this inside the carousel component so in the carousel component uh, in the return in the return in the return section we have this section tag inside this section tag we have two arrow which is the left arrow and the right arrow which you can see and uh, and this is the image which i have downloaded so which is present in this public folder inside this public folder we have this images folder and inside this images we have two svg uh, which is angle left solid angle right solid uh, which i am using here and and we also have this uh, <coughs> this array uh, which will traverse all the uh, all the status uh, like uh, all the data which we have present in this data.js file so here i imported this status carousel at the top i uh, import status carousel from from that data file so uh, <coughs> and uh, and we also add two class name uh, to uh, we add we use a function and inside this function we have passed this string left or right uh, when we click on this uh, uh, on the left icon it will pass this left uh, string and if we click on this right it will pass to the right so here is that uh, here is the handle slide function uh, inside this handle slide function first we get uh, by using dom uh, to that uh, the body of this carousel okay so when the direction is left we will scroll the slide bar to the minus 400 pixel uh, and if the scroll bar is uh, if the direction is right then we will slide the scroll bar uh, via 400 this is the dom property uh, uh, javascript property like if we, when any component any element have the scroll bar property uh, you can slide it via using <coughs> scroll by method and uh, the the main part of this uh, carousel is the css part okay uh, so let me also tell you this uh, evtr uh, component inside this avatar component we don't have any uh, we just need uh, passing this image data and uh, printing the values image dot uh, uh, image url and the image name okay so you can see we have a uh, few of the um, css which is written in this index.css file and uh, here is the styles.css we have two css uh, uh, all the css is only written in this carousel.css so so for that background i have using this background image uh, and put it the linear gradient so i will put the code uh, in the comment section you can see all the css uh, for what i am using uh, where i am using for what so so i hope you get some idea like how we can scroll this or so this is the way we can do this so 
if you like this video uh, please make sure give a like and don't forget to subscribe if you have any query then ask me in the comment section thank you so much